Hey guys, and welcome back. I just wanted to do a quick video on uh, making our succahash for supper tonight. Simple ingredients, chicken, potatoes for frying, bell peppers, onions, corn, and okra. Salt and pepper to taste. Super easy, quick meal to do up. It won't take much longer than 30 minutes. All right, so I already got the potatoes up frying. I'm gonna put a little bit of red bell peppers in there chopped onions in there and I have a little bit of green so we're just going to add that to it. Got to give everything a quick stir up, quick fry here. A little salt and pepper. And just give it a good mix to incorporate all of the seasonings together. I'm going to add the lid back to the pan to soften it up pretty fast. All right, so I put my chicken in the oven and baked it. I'm just gonna cut it into bite-sized pieces, which will go back into the mix when it's all cooked. And it doesn't make any difference if you use white meat or dark meat. These are chicken tenders that I got at the grocery store. All right, these are done. So I'm just gonna put them back here in this. I'm just trying to do a one pot skillet so I don't have a whole lot of dishes to do up. I'm gonna throw my chicken in there right quick. Give it a quick browning. Add a little salt and pepper to it. Add either a little bit of garlic powder or garlic salt or fresh garlic. Give it a little taste there. Just give it a stir and incorporate all of it together. I'm going to add just a little bit of butter to give it a little buttery flavor there. That's really not necessary. And turn the heat up just a little bit to get it to brown. All right, those are looking pretty brown, so we're just going to add it to our back mixture back here. Now I'll add a little bit more butter. Actually, I'm probably going to add the rest of this butter. Pick up the okra here. All right, we'll let that cook and we'll be back. All right, I've already given these one stir, so let's go ahead and do another stir. After your second turn, I would go ahead and add in your corn. And this is just bad frozen corn. If you've got canned corn, that's fine too.
All right, let's go ahead and give us another turn. Make sure this is all browned up really well. All right, I'm going to go ahead and add my whole mixture back, get it all warmed up. Give it about two or three more minutes to get warmed up, and then it is ready to eat. And I'll show you how I plate it up. And that popping you hear is the corn. All right. All right, that's going to do it. We'll get it served up. And that's just a really simple, quick, and easy meal. Less than 30 minutes. There you go. Thank you guys, and y'all have a blessed evening. Have a great day, evening, night, wherever you might be.